Wisconsin voter ID proponents are saying if you can't vote, you must not care. This guy, who's an absolute loon and maniac, um, Senator Glenn Grothman, also famous for saying, for hating the Martin Luther King Day because he believes, he says, let's be honest, giving government employees um, off has nothing to do with honoring Martin Luther King Day. And then he also said about Kwanzaa that it's white, it's white left wingers who are trying to shove, down, shove this down black people's throats in an effort to divide Americans. So this guy is just a known maniac. And this known maniac went a step further by saying, if you can't get your voter ID, that you just don't care enough about voting. Um, luckily for him, he represents a very, very white, wealthy suburbs near Milwaukee in the state Senate. And he doesn't have any folks in his district that are affected by these horrible, regressive voter ID laws like minorities, individuals that are poor, senior citizens, or students. So he can say whatever the hell he pleases while he limits the people's abilities to go to the voting box and vote. America, our voting rights is one of the top things we should care more. This is, it is key and fundamental to our democracy. And the fact that people like Mr. Grothman will go to the point that says, if you don't have a voter ID or you don't, if you're a senior citizen and you don't have a car to get to the place to get a voter ID, that therefore you don't care about voting is not only wrong, but I would argue that it's absolutely, positively, and totally un-American. So I would argue that Mr. Grothman is un-American. And anybody who stands up and promotes voter identification laws or anybody who tries to suppress people from going to the polls and, so, and, and expressing their democratic right as an American, they are un-American. And they trample on the Constitution each and every day, even though they wear it in their lapels. And they, wear it, they have it in their coat pockets. And they ride around with the American flag waved hell high. They trample on American values each and every solitary day.